हेलो फ्रेंड्स नमस्कार व्हाट इज दिस लाइफ 2.0 व्हाट आई मीन हियर इज द लाइफ आफ्टर दिस कोरोना लॉकडाउन हाउ इज दिस लाइफ इज गोइंग टू बी ओके व्हाट आर वी डूइंग राइट नाउ व्हाट आर द अपॉर्चुनिटीज ऑफ दिस लॉकडाउन वी गोइंग टू डिस्कस इन दिस सेमिनार आई वुड लाइक टू शेयर विद माय थॉट्स विद यू लास्ट ऑलमोस्ट वन मोथ और मोर I have been calling uh, our ex-students, my friends across the globe, and I have been talking with them, understanding what's happening there, what will happen or what might happen, and how can we be prepared for this life 2.0 or the life after Corona. I couldn't talk to each and every one of you, so thought of uh, creating a small video, maybe small interaction. With you all, for sure, Gappa, my dear, my views are there. Whatever views I have, I would like to share with you. I may be wrong, I may be right. I just want that you should understand my point of view, and you might get some different point of view. So this is for same. This is for our all ex-students, my current students, and other everyone, especially those into IT. Okay. So this when this Corona started, it created a panic. It was happening in China. It was happening in Italy. We were not bothered. We were having our own life, right? Our partying was continuing, roaming around, tripping. Everything was good going, right? But since the lockdown was announced, we were not ready, right? It was all sudden. We were not prepared for it. It created panic, definitely. I still remember first week. I got bored every day. I was having a habit, having a habit of going to class or going outside. So I got bored. Everybody might have got bored. Everybody was working from home, from the especially those who are in IT, but their productivity gone down. In week two point zero, everybody started becoming a bit serious, understanding the things, right? And then we are improving ourselves. If you're observing what happened in this last um, one and a half year, uh, one and a half months, sorry, is we are redefining the ways of doing same things. We are minimizing our all dependencies. Are we very dependent on maid? No, maid is not coming. We can't complain. In foreign countries, what we do? We do everything on our own. The same thing started in India, right? So we become our home. So we're supporting our families. Gyms were closed. Our lifestyle was different. Now we have to understand what can be lifestyle in the lockdown or after lockdown. So gyms got closed. I took it as an opportunity. From long time, I wanted to start running. I had a mental block that I cannot run more than three k. So I started running in Magarpatta in this area, and I achieved till twelve kilometers running. Normally, I can run now for one and half year, half hour. Okay. So, due to restrictions, even that was stopped. So we started d- d- downloading the apps from the Google Play Store for fitness. Started working out using these apps. So we are not giving any excuses. We are finding the ways of doing things. We have to redefine them now. We have to create new ways of doing same thing. Right? And you all must be doing same. There are some people those who don't have any goals, those who don't know what to do. For them, WhatsApp is keeping them busy. What are the sari challenge or uh, what people have done uh, recently was taking out the fo- old photos, commenting on them, laughing on it. Bit kind of destructive happiness. Anyways, people are enjoying it. The dalgona coffee, the dalgona pig, everything in that. So what I feel is we need to understand that how can we make the constructive use of this lockdown? It has never happened in our life, such a long time, right? I never was at home for such a long time. So what are the things we can do? First and foremost thing, what I mean, your entire family is at home now. Take advantage of this. increase that family bonding 
and most of the families everybody is busy their work timings are different now forcefully we are locked down we are at home so create that family bond more strong take out time and do that this will definitely help you in improving your family relations then what do you want to do till now in your daily structured life or a busy life a lot of times we we'll, we just look at a facebook or insta and we have we always want you know we have to do this or do that you know and we keep pushing those things in the stack and this stack has dynamically really grown and then we are we are just you know it is in my bucket list it's my wish list i want to do this so a lot of things now can be done during the lockdown so pop out things from the stack check out what things you can do and i i think people are doing it people are finding a time now to do um, the cooking right even uh, boys are learning cooking now and they are enjoying it people are finding time for drawings paintings all sort of creative work which you haven't got time in your you know busy life because the priorities were always the career marks studies money everything you know job we haven't got really a time till now to do what really we wanted to do right this is the time now if somebody says that i haven't got enough time that's just excuse it's not the real thing you can't say this after this right we got around 50 days of lockdown sitting at home nothing doing of course those who are working in it they are working from home i'm not talking about them they are definitely working a lot but we just you know wasting time sometimes um, watching money heist breaking bad what are the things we need to do earlier all those uh, backlog uh, of movies tv series or web series what i'll say that's good you know i'm not saying it's wrong you're engaging yourself but what i'm trying to tell you here is the life the corona the virus is it's affecting a lot it's impacting we're all staying at home to be safe there will be antivirus coming soon it will you know there will be uh, medicines which will really help us and this lockdown will be over but after that are we really prepared for the life 2.0 for the next coming up life things are going to be different now it's not going to be the same right for example for students those who are you know habitual of going to classes typically indian traditional mindset go to the college or bang the college attend the classes first understand the concept from the teachers and then before exam or just before the exam they'll open the books and study and the revise and for the marks we need to change our learning style studying style we should become now more sincere right so you know, for example like when you are sitting in a class or learning in a class i still remember when the teacher just goes out for one minute for some reason the immediately chaos starts you lose your focus teacher i asked you to read something solve some problem you don't want to right you immediately take out your mobile look at a whatsapp there's a lot of digital distractions we have i do understand but now in this lockdown time we have got so free time so much free time that we have to learn how to learn I always keep telling the keep telling in this class learn how to learn so this is time you have to learn how to learn so learn from youtube videos a lot of people are creating your contents on youtube now there is no end to the learning now there is huge now or a lot of information available that is bombarded you know uh, on the internet you have choice your options to what to learn right in different ways different people are there to guide you so it's you now to decide how to utilize this lockdown time and get ready prepare yourself for life 2.0 it's very really important right 
Now, the students uh, are in bit confusion right now about their exams. Recently, university is thinking of uh, cancelling the exam for first year, second year students, and they're really, really happy. Thank you to Corona, they'll be saying. The school kids till the eighth standard exams cancelled. They're also happy, right? But this is the infamous Corona vacation in their life. We'll be always discussing about this infamous vacation, right? Corona vacation. So what I want to say is, uh, because there is no exam, so no need to study. But try to understand, especially in the Indian mindset. Just because exams are there, we study. Otherwise, we don't study in the normal day like day to day life. Okay, special students coming to the class, they are not those you know, sincere kind of students who study every day. Otherwise, why do you require a class? So they will just uh, study before the exam. And if exams are gone, they won't study. Why will they study? And now there won't be any backlogs, so parents can't say anything to them. Now, if you don't study, how will you make your foundation strong to go to the next year, next academic year? For example, if FY student is there, what is your preparation for a second year? What is your preparation for third year? Right? So it's basically an exam you study, you make yourself, you prepare yourself for the next year to understand the next complicated concept, next higher level concepts. Otherwise, it will be very difficult for us to teach you in the next academic year if you don't know the previous year concepts thoroughly or properly, you know. So uh, I think you should take exam, but even if exams are not there, please, you have a lot of time. Take your time. I'm not forcing you to study for 24 hours or 8 hours a day. You keep enjoying your life. Keep watching that money heist or whatever TV series you want, movies. Yes, definitely it's important. Connect with people. Play games. Now you can't play real uh, physical world games. So play video games which you wanted to play. That's fine. But keep studying for 2-3 hours every day. Don't lose that reading habit. Okay. Keep studying. You have to make your foundation strong. What are you going to study? If you think your programming was weak, start from for first year. Start from the first program of your C. Start working on it. You haven't got enough time during the college days because you're busy in a college, class, practicals, traffic here and there. You haven't got enough time to study. Now you have that time. So sit at home. Start from the first program. Many of the numbers, max of the numbers, addition of the numbers, slowly, slowly, slowly increase the complexity and keep doing it practically. Struggle on your own. Now there is nobody who will, you know, directly help you in finding your, you know, mistakes or uh, spoon feeding you. Like what happens in the class labs, the lab faculty helps you or your uh, friend who is sitting on your, on your bench, the neighbor is immediately pointing out your mistake or helping you. you should have, there should be a semicolon. This, this logic is wrong. Your for loop will not work. There is nobody. So try on your own. Learn how to learn. Learn on your own. You have to become independent now. And this will help you in the entire your future. In building your career. Right. Now those are in uh, final year. They might be a bit disturbed right now because you have to prepare for exam. You don't know exam. What will be exam pattern? Right. But keep studying. Right. If you study completely. Uh, see the questions. Uh, it's not important to know all the answers. You know. But. What is going to give you confidence is how much you prepared for the exam, how much you studied. And uh, every time it happens that we always have excuse that we haven't got enough time for studies because uh, there was a practical, there was a submission, this and that happened at family. No, there is no excuse. You got enough, enough time to study. Enough. You can start reading from reference. We can start again from the first chapter, from the history. You can start reading and then you can build your all concepts. You can make this really, really, you know, uh, Great use of time. Make your concepts thorough. What do you need to understand till now? It's a time to understand. Right? Watch YouTube videos. I wanted to create a, a lot of videos and put the contents uh, on the internet. So I took this time uh, subject of compiler construction. You know, something new that I did. Which I didn't do earlier. The, again, the benefit of lockdown. I got time. So I create more than 35 videos on the compiler construction. Of course, they're not teaching you anything, but those already learned and preparing for exam. While solving the question papers, they got a lot of doubts. If you refer to the question for solutions, EQPS, a lot of typing mistakes. And the students, those who don't understand typing mistake, try to waste their time and understand how the solution is correct. Whereas the actual solution is wrong. Right? So if I just show them a photo of my final solution, they don't understand how you come to this solution. How do you get first follow? How do you get leading trailing? 
So I showed them live solving, you know, how I came to the answer. And I'm sure it's definitely helping them in their studies, like preparing for exam for compiler construction. So I want to create a lot of videos, you know, which will uh, help the students sitting at home, learning new things. And not only technical, you know, because uh, now there are so many students watching my video and who are who have more knowledge than me in IT or technical or more experts. I'm really happy some students even have them in their own companies. So I'm also thinking of putting up some non-technical videos, which I have, uh, you know, my experience, sharing my experiences, right? Which will help them in their day-to-day -day life or in their life. So if you want to, you know, uh, uh, get notifications whenever I post new videos, please subscribe my channel. So that every time I post new video, you will get the notification. And I'll create a separate playlist. The way I created a playlist for compile question, I create a separate playlist for uh, other topics. Long time I want to create a video series of uh, law of attraction, which is my favorite topic. I don't get enough time in the classroom to teach this simple thing in my uh, classes because I have to always focus on my syllabus. But believe me, there are three things as I told all this time, hard work, guidance, and the luck. Most of us just believe in the hard work. Some are lucky to get guidance, but we don't work on this luck factor. Mm -hmm. So if you work on the law of attraction, there's a famous movie called Secret. A lot of people, those who heard from me or might be knowing about the secret. So work on that law of attraction. You can get everything in your life. Anyways, I'm going into it. I'll create a separate uh, series on this law of attraction. It's a really interesting topic. A lot mixed right now. So uh, these are freshers right now. Those who are final students, prepare yourself, get graduated. And then some students who got uh, offer letters. It's possible that your jobs might get delayed. Your joining it might get delayed. Don't take tension. Uh, if, you are, if you don't want to wait for a long time, uh, think of joining some startup companies. They'll give you wonderful experience. Not a great salary, but you'll get a wonderful experience. You'll learn a lot. So don't uh, be idle you know, after graduation or right now. If you don't get till you did a job, do some projects. Till whatever knowledge you have gained till now, do some projects on your own, right? Combine your teams. Doesn't matter what college you belong to, what course you're doing, maybe engineering, MCA, uh, MCS, BCS, all you can come together, team up. Increase your skill set. If you like programming, do that. If you like backend programming, if you like data programming, if you like no, whatever uh, testing, do that. Form a team. And develop projects. Develop. Uh, there are a lot of freelancers. So do freelancing. Get a real experience. It's required. The knowledge that you're getting from books, apply that knowledge. Otherwise, it will be useless. The real thing that you get only when you start actually working, you know. So get an experience. So don't waste the time. Don't be idle. Those are not getting jobs. Those haven't got jobs. As I said, do freelancing. Those still lack lack in the uh, communication skills, speaking in English. Start speaking English. Watch different videos. Instead of people are just, uh, you know, maybe because due to many high people are now interested in Spanish. <laughs> Learn those foreign languages. I, I do agree, but right now your time. But focus mainly on communication skills, mainly English, and to crack this um, company's uh, aptitude test. Many BC students, you lack in aptitude. You know, in, it's good in thing in engineering. They are good in aptitude of maths, but we lack behind. So get aptitude books. There are a lot of material available on the internet for aptitude. So prepare yourself for a interview. Create a good resume. Okay, buy data. Prepare for interview. A lot of uh, watch. A lot of in. Interviews, videos, aptitude, learn different techniques. So what is required for getting a job? Communication skills, aptitude, technology, of course. Prepare on it. Right now your time to prepare. Make yourself sellable for job market. So try to understand. I have seen this slowdown in 2001. In 2008, there was swine flu in 2011. People might remember it. It's excellent. And again, now it's in 2020. But this time things are different. If you observe what was necessary in this lockdown time, only two things. The medical 
and the grocery stores, the vegetables. So prepare yourself, make yourself saleable, like that bhaji, grocery, make yourself like a sanitizer. What I mean to say is, become that necessity. Company should hire you. And if you already got the job, prove it to the company, become, make use. You have to work hard, smart rather, not hard. Become an asset to the company. You should become necessity of the company. And especially in India, we work in teams and our teams are really huge. Yani kaam nahi to karel. What lethargic lifestyle. People come to the office around 10, 10, 30. You go for lunch for around 1 o'clock. And literally we have around 1 hour lunch time. I was in people, you know, strolling after lunch. The companies. What I want to say here is become versatile. Don't be demanding. This is not a time. Hatha fielding is a time. Chan fielding kara. Batting is a time. Batting kara thail. En cash nanta kara thail. Hatha experience gya. Jo middle te kam kara baka. Hold on to your jobs. Spill those who have got jobs. Hold on to your jobs. Because it's happening now. This company is will it's going to affect every market rather. It's not only a variety. So there will be job cuts. There will be layoffs. A lot of people might come back from US to India back. They are going to replace here people. And it's going to impact the whole hierarchy. I'm not trying to threaten you. I'm just trying to make you, you know, giving you ideas that you'll be prepared for this life 2.0. So if you are necessity of the company, you will survive. You don't have to worry about things. Don't be just an option in the team. Become a necessity. That's really important. Okay. So, uh, that's it. I wanted to talk a lot, uh, but there is no real audience. Okay, and uh, we can have such more uh, videos, small, small snippets, whatever I want to think, I will think, whatever my thoughts are, I'll come up, come to you again then through this small, small video series. But uh, try to understand, you know, this uh, before lockdown, things were really different. Life was different. We're looking at happiness for the in outside world, partying, boozing. And in this lockdown time, we have learned the happiness is not outside, it's inner. Okay. A lot of people are going to A lot of people, those who have uh, got addictions of smoking, boozing. Addictions, smoking, drinking. Right. So make a positive use of this time. Back available nights. People are gaining weight. For me, I have taken it as an opportunity. I'm trying to, you know, become more fit. I'm not saying losing weight, but I'm working on a fat loss, exercising more. And good thing, lockdown is helping me because now outside all restaurants, partying, and all those things are closed. So the only option you have is to have a home food, and that is really, really good. The oil that we use instead of eating a vada pav on that outside gadi, and we don't know what kind of oil they use. The fry, refry, 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 a lot of unsaturated fats. You did say what up at home. The taste might be a bit different, but it will, of course it will be good, but that won't have affect your health much. What it affects getting outside. Right. So what I want to say is this is the time. Don't waste it. Utilize this time. Positively be positive. Stay at home. And prepare yourself life. For life 2.0. It's coming up soon. The lockdown will be over. We have to prepare ourselves right now. For the next things. Thank you very much for watching my video. Sparing some time. And please, please, please. If you under, have liked my thoughts. If you want like my, I should uh, create some small videos again in future. Uh, like video, my video. Do subscribe my channel. I'll keep posting you more and more videos, technical as well as non-technical. And in comments, write me suggestions. Thank you very much. Have a nice time. Have a great lockdown time. Bye-bye.